Okay, in my last video, I showed how to create a soccer ball in AutoCAD. But then I found out that Autodesk has removed the ability to export FBX files from the program, which basically put the brakes on my whole AutoCAD to Blender workflow. I had been using AutoCAD 2018 for many years, and I only recently upgraded to 2023 when I got my new computer. And to my surprise, there is no FBX export option anymore. So I decided to find out how to create the same soccer ball in Blender. And it's actually much easier and faster. And of course, I don't need to deal with exporting and importing and all of that. So yeah, let's get into it. Okay, the first thing I'm going to do is hit A and then X and delete. Next, I'll come over to the Scene Properties tab, Units, and set the length to centimeters. Next, I'll hit Shift A, Mesh, and Icosphere. And I'll come down here to the menu, set subdivisions to 1, and the radius to 34. Now I'll hit Tab. Go to edit mode. That will put me into vertex selection mode automatically and all the vertices are selected. So I'll hold down control shift and hit B to go into bevel mode. I'll drag out a little bit here and then left click to stop the bevel. And I'll set the width to 12. Next, I'll come up to the Face menu and Extrude Individual Faces. And I'll drag up just a little bit and left click. And I'll set the offset to 0.2. So I have just a little bit of an extrusion there. Now I'll come back up to Face and select Poke Faces. Then I'll right click. Subdivide, and I'll set the number of cuts to 8. Now I'll hold down the Control key and hit the minus key on my number pad twice to reduce the number of vertices that I have selected. Next I'll hit S to scale and drag up. And I'm going to set the X, Y, and Z all to 1.05. Then I'll go to the Vertex menu and Smooth Vertices. Now I'll hit Tab and go to Object Mode. Then right click and Shade Smooth. I'll come to the Modifier panel and add a cast modifier. And I'll set the factor to one. And that looks pretty good, so I'll assign modifier. I'll go to the material panel, and I'm gonna create a couple materials. First one will be called white. And I'll click on the base color bar here and drag the slider all the way up to the top. Then I'll click the plus, hit new again. I'll call this one black. And I'll drag the slider for this one all the way to the bottom. Now I'll hit tab, go to edit mode. I'm going to select this vertex right here in the center of this five sided polygon. Then I'll hold down Control and hit the plus key on the number pad until all the vertices are selected. Then I'll hit Shift G and select Face Regions, and that will select all the five sided polygons. Now, with the black color selected, I'll click the Assign button. Then I'll hit Control I to invert the selection, switch to the white and assign. Then I'll hit tab and go to object mode. Now you can't see the colors yet, 
because of the vertex or the uh, viewport shading mode. So we'll come up here to the material preview. And there we go. Now the only thing left would be to come down here to roughness. I'm going to set this to 0.3 so we get a little bit more gloss. Go back to the white and do the same thing. Okay, there you have it. If you watched my AutoCAD soccer ball video, then I'm sure you'll agree that this, this uh, process is much faster and easier. For my next video, I think I'll create a grass field and uh, render out an image. But uh, that's it for this one. If you have any questions or comments, go ahead and post them below. And as always, if you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next one.